Hello, hello, hello. I'm back. It's May and I have a Tuesday morning call to share with you guys. Now, I have been looking for um, a die cut machine that I can um, emboss and cut, but I also want the die cut machine that will allow me to cut chipboard because you guys know I love chipboard. Now, I had gifted out my other um, machine a while back ago and I kept searching now that I've gotten back to crafting um, to see if I can find a machine similar to it but not so expensive because I can't spend a lot of money but I um, searched high and low on the internet you know all the used ones they wanted a lot of money for it um, you know, Amazon was asking, I think, $89 for a new one, and I wasn't about to spend that kind of money. So today, I happened to go into Tuesday morning, and I was just walking around, checking to see what they have, and not really looking for the machine because it wasn't, like, right at my face. I was looking at the papers, I was looking at um, stamps, and I was looking at the embellishments, but I did not see any big boxes or anything that would stick out. Then I turned around because I was looking for something, a container, to put some of my embellishments in that would be stored away and it wouldn't clutter up my little office here for school. And there it was. I saw this box and it looked kind of odd. And I'm like, wait a minute, that box looks familiar. It looks like the box I used to have when I had that same machine that I got rid of. I looked. And there it was, heavenly sent. God is amazing, guys. I can't express that anymore. God is amazing. So, guess what I found for $50. The very same machine I had gifted away um, about a year or so ago. Um, and here it is, back, and I paid $49.99. Now, it was buried underneath some cake decor behind where all the um, decorative boxes are. I'm not sure why anyone put it back there and unless someone was hiding it, but it was there and they had another one. So if you are close to any Tuesday morning, just look around underneath all the stuff. Someone's hitting it, but here it is, $50. And they had another one here uh, left, but it was really pushed back. So someone's trying to make sure that they come back for these and unfortunately God put it where I could see it so I was excited about being able to use this get this back because not only do I love the color but this baby allows me to cut chipboard it allows me to cut fabric it allows me to emboss it allows me to um, you know chipboard thickest chipboard that I always use fabric um, emboss it does it all for me and I love this machine the only problem that I had to say is because of my arthritis I had a little bit problem cranking every now and then but that was just me um, I can get over that for 50 bucks I can totally get over that so I'm very excited about this purchase I also found some embossing folders to show you that I can use with my new machine Eric might not like it, you know, I stumble across that, but I was happy. It's going to keep me a little bit busy um, in the next couple weeks. All right, so I found this embossing folder from Spellbinders. I love circles and things like that. I don't know why I'm fascinated by it, but I found this one for $1.99, and it's Spellbinders. I found this one. I love doing mixed media things, so this would be a really nice background as well as this one. If you stamp it, especially like a really thick aluminum, and then put some um, chalk paint, any rustic things, anything to make it pop out. Um, these are really nice. Paint. Here's another one for two seventy nine. Uh, and then I got this one. For $2.49 as well. It, see, this is the kind of stuff I like. So you can emboss it, you can paint it, um, you can take your mediums and you know whether it's gesso or um, uh, paste and 
the uh, rub-ons, the little rub, rubby thingies that I used to use a lot from Prima. Um, I can't remember what they are right now. But anyway, you can do that. So now on my agenda is to find those rubs that I used to have. So that's my next purchase. It's not right now. Okay, then I found this paper pad. And I like the colors and I like it looks kind of vintagey and it has um, a lot of retro stuff. So I think it would go good with my journal that I'm going to be working today. And I'll be using that. So I'll be cutting off of that for my little journal that I'm going to be creating with. And then I found Vicky, Vicky I'm Burton's stickers. And I thought, you know, they had an additional 25% off anything that's on clearance. So from the dollar 49, this was 20% off plus D25. So I thought, okay, not too bad. Not too bad. Um, I found these as well in the clearance section. And it would go good with my journal that I'm going to be working on for Sherry Body. So I thought those colors match it well. And I got an additional... 20 plus 25 percent off discount on that and I got these rub-ons from Tim Holtz for $1.99 I love butterflies I'm fascinated um, as well as with circles I'm fascinated with butterflies and I wanted to make some 3d butterflies um, embellishments and I got these for $2.99 from Bow Bunny and I got this one here so I can stamp some cards some ephemera cards and it has some flowers and some other scripts in there announcements and stuff so that'd be good to pre-stamp some things I thought these were really cool looking they had lots of them I got a couple of them um, these are stickers but they're 3d stickers and I got them for a uh, dollar actually 99 cents sorry so I got one two three of those and then I had this one and it has family so I thought you know what those are appropriate um, they're not too too bad for the price and I can use them for some of my upcoming projects so I know then I had gone to the land to exchange those Fiskars punches that I can't use because of my arthritis in my hand they don't do refund. That's how much I know. They don't refund anything that's on clearance. So I had to bring that back. But I went around looking for a tab punch. And I couldn't find um, anything that there. But then I went to my favorite place, Tuesday morning, where you can find all these Memory Keeper punch boards. Very, very affordable. Um, at Tuesday morning I unless you have a 50% coupon with an additional 20 I don't suggest you pay these at regular price at the retail store so I went to Tuesday morning and I found it $11.99 and with the 40 it was 20 at 45 um, I think I paid like seven something 749 I have to do the math again but yeah I think it was like 749 if I'm not mistaken um, I thought it should have been more, but I'll have to look at the receipt. Um, the receipt here. Let's see what I paid. Hopefully they took off the extra 20%, 25%. Um, typewriter is 99. Okay, so I saved 480 on my tab punch. So it was 719 don't have my calculator with me but I'm assuming they did it right let's see do I have a calculator in here I want to do my math anyway I will assume that they they took off 45% uh, which it should be because half of it's right 719 I trust them because half of 1199 um, is six so it was 45 that they took off so a little bit over seven so yeah that's right okay then um, I got my so I got the tab punch for 719 not bad and then I got these little clips because it matches the album that we're gonna be creating today 
for Sherry Baldy. $1.99 Heidi, Heidi Swap. Not bad. Um, oh, and I got um, this little um, Project Life stamp to put dates and stuff like that. Let me use that in the project today. And then I got another um, embossing folder for $1.99 from Spellbinders. And I love the textures on these. And these make great make me mixed media background so then I got this because hopefully it will um, match the project that we're working for Sherry Baldy today I can use these as little uh, embellishments for today's project and of course you guys saw my biggest find which is my um, big shot machine I'm super excited about that Mr. Larson probably won't be so excited to see that <laughs> but um, he does try to um, he does try to make me happy, and right now this is gonna definitely make me happy. So I'm gonna be jumping on here shortly, and you guys are gonna be able to see me create um, a junk journal using Sherry Baldy's junk journal kit, and I will put a link below so you can purchase that kit, but also use the coupon uh, for that kit. We are going to be going live at 5.30 Eastern, 4.30 Central, 3.30 Mountain, 2.30 Pacific Standard Time. And get out any old projects that you have because we're calling this the YouTube Retreat, Craft Retreat. It's going to be online craft retreat. So just take out, sit back, get your coffee. I have my tea. Get your coffee, get your tea, get your drink. Get whatever you have and let's sit back and create something stress-free no thinking just finish any project that you haven't you've meant to finish and you haven't gotten the chance to finish this is the perfect time today 4 30 we'll stop whenever everyone says let's stop let's take a break but it's going to be um however long we can stay online and however long youtube allows us to stay online um we will be here creating a journal kit using Sherry Baldy's journal kit and we will also be doing other things so if you are up to it meet us today and I will see you then bye